All right, so what are we trying to do here? We're trying to find the measure of angle BVC, uh, and I'm told that ray VB bisects angle AVC, and the measure of angle AVC equals 158 degrees. And I should be able to use that information to find the measure of angle BVC. Oh, this is so confusing. I think what I need to do is draw a picture. So let's see, I'll draw an angle here. All right, so we have an angle being bisected. And that angle is ABC. So I'm going to put an A, V, a C. And we're told that ray VB bisects this angle. So I'll put ray VB. So I'm just kind of go through here like this. There's a B out here. Told that we're told it bisects it. So these two are the same size. Notice I've drawn this arc a little bit further out than this one. That way I can see that I'm marking the two separate angles as congruent and not simply marking, if I were just brought one arc all the way through, it would be suggesting like I was just marking one angle for one big angle for no particular reason. All right, so with that, next we're told, let's see, we've got um, measure of AVC is 158. So the big angle is 158. So the measure of angle BVC and that is BVC, just this half of it, right, because they're two congruent halves, equals 158 divided by 2. Uh, so the measure of angle BVC, see 158 divided by 2, 150 divided by 2 would be 75, so 158 would be plus another 4 or 79 degrees. All right. Ta-da!